feeling a little nostalgic this morning with this espresso machine over here getting a nice and uh classical yo this coffee is so good like es or it's a technical espresso it's so good so if there's anything that i've learned so far from selling these tickets is two things one converting people to sales from them enjoying your content to actually selling them something is just as incredibly hard as i thought and two i am in incredibly surprised how supportive my friends have been like my friends are good friends but like they never really talk much about my music it's not i never really get like they hear like hey i heard your new song it sounds great kind of thing we don't it's just not really talked about kind of thing so i didn't really think that they really i don't i don't know if the cared is the right word or like i know they care but like i didn't know they really supported it for it but like the second ticket bought was from a good friend, my, uh, a really good friend of mine, and she even texted me. She's like, "Whoa, look at this concert! This is so exciting! Like, I just want to let, I, like, I'm so pumped for you. I got my ticket already." I was like, "What? Like, you bought a ticket?" And now, two really good friends of mine just bought the $100 VIP passes, which comes with like lunch with me the next day, which is funny because we hang out all the time, but it also comes with merch. It also comes with a recording of the thing. I'm sure that they just did it really to support, but like, geez, man, like if I'm learning anything, it's really how supportive my friends are. Maybe it's because I never really gave them the opportunities to support because I really haven't asked for anything from the community in, in a really long time. Even like gigs, like I used to play a lot of gigs a lot. So I'd be like, hey, come to people like, you know post on my instagram come down and watch me play at the wine cellar kind of thing and people would show up just because they wanted to go out and you know they would be able to hear some music and ha hang out with their friends but like i haven't asked even that because you know because i haven't been playing gigs so i guess it's the first time in a long time i've had the, the opportunity for people to support but like for my friends to drop 215 dollars to support me it's like that's i'm about to actually call them right now and be like yo that's crazy and like i just show my appreciation man that's crazy yeah Wait, what so I've been calling the friends that bought tickets, which by the way, let's be real front and honest so far. We've only sold five tickets and three of them are friends. Two of them are live stream uh, supporters. So we still got 995 to go. We still got a long way to go. 73 days until the concert. <laughs> Oh shoot, man, we gotta go hard, we gotta go hard. But I called them and I, I one of them was saying like, we believe in you and you know, you guys have always helped us out and supported us and we wanna support you. So it's it's kinda cool to see actually, almost like the give and you shall receive kind of thing. They were like, you know, you and Jamie are always so generous to us and we wanted to bless you. And, and not only did we wanna bless you back, but we, 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 we will, these words were actually meant a lot. We believe in you and we wanna support you and and we're excited for you. Shoot, and first of all, it was really cool, it was almost like, wow, like, <laughs> the Bible is true, <laughs> like, it's like, it's like proof, it's like, when you actually are generous to people, it actually does come back to you, you know what I mean? And then, on top of that, to hear that they believe in me, like, he's like, you know, just, just keep crushing it, you know, like, that's cool, man, like, I don't know, to some degree, maybe you're not allowing the people around you to have the opportunities to show that they support, you know? I don't know. I always thought they didn't support, but I just never really gave them the opportunity to. So I don't know. Maybe, but I, I, I don't know because I know at the beginning people were very skeptical. So I, I don't know where that line shifted or if it was always just maybe it was in my head. I don't really know. But the point is right now, I know that I am incredibly impressed and incredibly grateful.